Good evening, I'm Frost. I'm here with Amanda, and she's hosting a community event. This is called the Two Step, right? Two Step. We do all sorts of dancing, though. Country how long dancing. have you been doing this? I've been teaching here for about two and a half, three years. It's a pretty good chunk of time. So, Excellent. Yeah. So of all the events that you've done, what has made it most easy for you to come back and build a community around this event that you're doing? People coming to it. Dance is my passion. Later, we'll have social dancing and okay. watching them dance with everybody else is kind of really interesting and fun. Very cool. Well, so for a first timer, somebody that's never been before, how do you make it comfortable for them to be part of this group? I think the lessons help. The lessons. It gives them that little basis of what we do and um, I give them kind of the rules and the ground stuff for when it gets busy because it'll get busy. <laughs> that makes sense. And what has been so far with your biggest challenge in putting these events on in partnership with Schmiggity's? Advertising throughout town, getting the word out. But with us being together for so long, it's kind of built its own name. I can so. see that too. There's already 20 people Hi. right as soon as you open the doors at 7 p.m. that show up. So uh, yep. great job on keeping a consistent <laughs> following. So let's get out here and do some dancing. Sounds good. Right on. Thank you. All right. So we're going to go from the top. So we're going to roll, roll, one, two, three, step, roll, step. Now for the slight challenge. So as I do my rock step, I'm gonna prep my right foot pointing towards that wall. That way it spins my body as I go to step. One, two, three, bend flat. One, two, three, step, pivot. One, two, three, step, pivot. And roll. Roll. Just do a 180. One, two, three, right. Right, two, three, step right, left, two, three, step right, step right, that's your problem right there. Step the right foot. And then pivot, let go of the right hand. Over right hand. There you go. Over right hand. 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 Right because you bring a lot of passion to this place and it seems like dancing is something that you really enjoy. I do. What is most inspiring to you about a community event like this, bringing people together? I guess just showing people that anything's possible. If you're insecure or whatever, you can do whatever the hell you want. You have that inside you. Everyone has it inside them. It just needs to be unlocked in a certain way. And finding what unlocks the inner passion inside you, that's a good shit. How did you get into this? I work at the home ranch. I asked a girl to dance. The band was playing, and apparently I was doing so bad with this girl. The band member came down and gave us private instruction. I can never let this happen again. I came to Smiggity's, I uh, watched YouTube videos, and I learned how to dance my ass off. And eventually I became very good. Girls started asking me for dances. Then it became like an obsession, in a way. Well, I gotta go every Tuesday, regardless of everything else. And I come here to injuries and other adversities. I enjoy this atmosphere and I enjoy this place. Colorado's been great to me, you know, since I come here. I definitely feel more confident in my abilities, so, yeah. So one of the reasons we really started talking is because you, you mentioned that you love to lead by example. I think that's a great motto that I learned in the Marine Corps, man. I really appreciate that about you. And I want to know, leading by example, what makes a good community event? What makes it so you are passionate and you want to come every Tuesday and show up for this? Just getting people involved, recognizing that certain people want to participate, but maybe they're a little bit shy and they don't know what they're doing. Show them the way, motivate them in some fashion to get on, a, on, on the dance floor. They come here, you can see they want to dance, just make them want to dance. It's not that intimidating after all. As long as you, know, you have a good leader, they can follow along and learn eventually. As long as you have a strong leader, then you can do whatever. I mean, it doesn't 
Yeah, it doesn't matter after that. Are you interested in eventually hosting your own community event? Yeah. I would be, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah for sure. Yeah. Well, thanks for taking the time to speak with me, man. Yeah, no problem. Great to be with you. Yeah, you too. Thank you.